Okay, you can see what we're running. We're running four on the floors, Ford Fastbacks, and we're running project cars, modding teams, Ferrari GTO, and the rest are standard at Laguna Sega. We're running at 110%. And go, go, go. it's old school racing. The car model is beautiful in here, just lots of detail. I said we're running the AI on 110%, so they are going to run away from me. These cars are highly strung, shall we say. 1960s technology, suspension and tyres. So you've got to respect it as such, because these cars were made for the road and basically to uh, go very quick in a straight line. Not necessarily quick around the corners. So your slip angles are, um, well, let's not call them slip, ang left. slip angles, let's just call it scream angles. You're getting the slip angle in this, you're fighting Still it to there. get it out Clear again. Left. Left side. Those GTOs left. Left quite side. well matched. Clear left. Right side. The other cars up in front. That's said I'm running 110, so they are running quicker Clear than right. me. Just so we get to look at some of the cars right. at the back. Screws and nightmare in this, you can hook it at the top, believe it or not. You can hook it on any corner, really. It's just as soon as you hear that, those tyres scrubbing, yeah, panic. I don't get on the power too soon because it will just spin it there as well. Get the big heavy belt stopped. So the Nimble GTL has a look at the inside. If we're not saying a lot, and it looks like we're driving slow, it's because I'm trying to balance the car. This is not a GT3, it's not half of NASA's computer budget keeping me in a straight line on the tarmac. This is one up from a wholesome cart, V8 stuffed in the front. We're going to get taken by another GTO here. Yeah, car left. Yep. Still there, clear left. Point where you you meet you, you, you get the kind of uh, terminal velocity where you can actually nail it in a corner, but um, if you come on too early, it's it's game over. Yeah, I can see some C3s behind us. I don't choose to catch yourself. Second, and touch the brakes. That's how lazy it is up through the revs. You are uh, gaining a lot of speed, but the gear ratios are so tall. Oh, that's not what you want to do over one of Carty's sausages. That's a second, hook it in. Again, feeding the power on an old. It's a bit like um, Chester's. The gap to Stevenson ahead is increasing. It's now 8.7 seconds. 
or juggling live piranha. Be another good uh, analogy. At any moment, it might take my fingers off. Not that chest takes your fingers off, but live piranhas do. You know what I mean. Okay, I was losing the bat then. What have we got? Okay, one more lap. TTL's just leaving me down the straight. Left. We're on my own. Should be about three laps of fuel left. That was a one forty point eight. We're catching the slower cars now. Lipping on the downshifts. Nice force feedback off these. Get a good sense of weight. Of which they have it all. All the weight. That was better. I'm getting cocky now. I'm playing with uh, drift angles. So it's not, not really a, a good thing to do in these. Slower cars ahead. These guys are slugging it out of position. Class leaders in this group. <laughs> okay, so I can, I can catch them and then hang with them and then we get on the straight and they're going to leave me. Don't think there's any passing opportunities. Oh, that was a bit deep. I'm going to wait a bit though. Oh, back end's gone. Come back. Yeah, the thing with these, because of the weight of it and the style of tyres. Their tyres, once you start sliding this thing around, the tyres just get eaten and get very hot very quick. Let's try a clock back. Not going to work. Um, uh, yeah, so you've got to manage your tyres quite heavily. Anyway, thanks for watching. It's just a short one. We're going to jump on some formula stuff now. In fact, I'm not. I'm going to do another lap because I can't count. Was doing four laps. Lower cars ahead. These guys are fighting for position. Right, it gives me another Take chance. So it's been doing all the uh, stuff at the end. Just kept with my whoa, 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 All tyres. Okay, we're just getting the last lap, and it's um, it's a religious thing. You know what's going to happen on the last lap, so we're really going to push it. Sausage. Place your bets. There's only uh, four more corners to go. It's going to be one of them. That one. Right. So who had Ben number three? You are a winner. <laughs> and it comes to C3 Corvettes. We'll have a look at them as the uh, Bimble passed. Car left. Line. We'll have a look at them. Not take a paint sample. Jeepers. If you want to race them? Then you can just go solo on them. And um, just up their AI yeah, level, right. so the uh, it levels out the BOP for you. Right, thanks for watching. Me absolutely uh, set fire to a set of tyres. Adios.